So you guys took our whole thing of cubes that had eight in it, and you broke it into what? What did you break it into? This. Yes. Four. Are they all equal parts? Yes. So is that a fraction then? Yeah. What fraction did you make? Quarters. You made quarters. Okay. Now let's think about this. Could we, when you make another fraction, let's try and make halves or a half. How many parts are there in a half? Two. So there's two parts. So what could you do with that to make two parts? So you, you've taken the part. Now, I, when I look at this, it still shows quarters. So what do I need to do to make this two parts? Are you able to attach something together maybe? Okay, and now what about the other side? So, you made a half now? Okay, now let's see if you can make any other fractions. All right, remember the pizza that we worked on yesterday? And remember we have our anchor chart where you can look at, okay? I know that. So, what have you guys created here with our our blocks? Hey, what, let me what fraction is that? Hey, a whole. It's one whole. Okay, now let's make an, can you show me what the fractions that you know? What, what could you make? What fraction is that? It's uh, four it's plus half. four. It's half. Why is it half? Because four plus four makes eight. Then you break it in half. Each, each part has four. So, and we have two, how many parts? We have two parts, right? Can you make another fraction? Sure. Oh, you do it. What fraction is that? Quarters. How do you know that? Because each, each side has two. Okay, so we have four equal parts. Excellent. So I heard you guys talking. What fraction did you guys create? Uh, four and four. So of the whole, what fraction is that? How, how would you say you broke the whole? You broke it? Uh, fractions. Well, fractions. But what fraction? Do you remember what the name is? So you took it and you broke it in... Half. In, uh, there's your fraction. You broke it in half. How many parts do you have of it? Four. Is there four? Oh, I mean, how much? Well, how, well, what are you holding in your hand? You have, how many parts do you have in your hand? One, two, two. Yeah, we have two parts, so there's our half. Now, let's think. Can you think of another fraction you can make? Nah. Let's think about money. Remember, what's our fraction that connects us with money? Mm. What? Oh, look, you just broke it into something. Put that on the ground. Let's put it on the ground. Put it right so we can look at it. How many parts did you make? I made um, uh, one, two, three, four. Are they all the same size? Yes. So is that a fraction then? Yes. yes. So how many parts do you have? You have four parts. Four. What fraction is that? Do you remember? Mm. You broke it into? Doubles. Not doubles. Halves. Not half. Well, you broke the half into halves. So that means, I want. if I think about my connection, I have four parts. Do you remember what four coins make a dollar? Do you remember one coin, if you use four of them, you make one dollar. Do you remember what it is? Okay, so what do you think this fraction is called then? One of these is a quarter. And now you're breaking it up again, bud. What are you breaking? Would you have equal parts of this? How many would you have? You would have, um, let's see. When you take this one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, okay. One, two, three, four, four, six, four, five, six, seven. Six, Seven, eight. So what did you break it into then? We broke it eight. into eight. High five. Nine. You guys made some awesome fractions with this. Great job.